romantic comedies, the couple always meets under adorable circumstances. You know, they get stuck on an elevator, hate each other instantly. 90 minutes later, after the slow-mo courtship montage, they're married. But online, you don't have to overcome your immediate disdain for someone. You can get exactly what you want, for better or worse. Holly Morgan is here with that. Yeah, I hate to break it to you, but sharing a food allergy or maybe a love of llamas with someone doesn't necessarily make them marriage material. Go figure. But if you are looking for love online, get out that iPad and take some notes because that's today on The Soap. I am so jealous of the guy who gets to marry you. Well, that could have been you. Yeah. That's what I was leaning towards. Yeah. If you're trying to avoid another dating disaster, you should probably skip sites like clownpassions.com. <laughs> Okay, so you meet thanks to your love of mullets, but when the date goes bad, you're really left with a guy with a bad haircut. What? New apps like Wingman pair you with other passengers looking for love that'll hopefully last past the runway. But if you really want your online love life to soar to the altar, we asked our experienced dater, I, I mean expert, Candy Gway for a list of tips. Studies say that people like specific sites as far as dating goes but most of the time a match or an eHarmony is gonna be a lot better as far as expanding your reach. First, time is love, people. The effort you put in is equal to the seriousness of the dater, such as eHarmony where 400 questions are asked for your online dating profile. It's gonna be way better odds for you to meet somebody. Next, you gotta pay to play. Free sites are a problem. If you're not paying anything to get involved, such as a Tinder or a friendfinder.com, you're basically going into it not looking for a serious mate or somebody who is serious about dating. And do a double take. Whether it be a friend, a family member, a coworker that's not gonna judge you, somebody that's willing to tell you that you look bad online. This explains why I didn't find a husband on Match. <laughs> Cause I didn't have you go over it. Remember when you put Wiener Lover on there? <laughs> Webbing your match online on the social. I love dachshunds. I'm a single mother of two. That's true.